Well, the goal of this mirror badge, aviation mirror badge, is a little bit different than many of them. Instead of being able to easily do it at a campsite in one day or one afternoon, this is a little bit more involved. The first part of the mirror badge is the study of uh, basic aeronautics. What makes a plane fly? The characteristics of flight on the wings, on the fuselage, on the tail surfaces, the importance of the engine, and the instrumentation. Well, that first part is a classroom, and actually in this in this case, we're taking it last because we have some other fun things to do, like visit the airfield, which is part of the mayor badge. We have uh, gone to the St. Joseph uh, Airport, uh, Rosecrans Memorial, and we've done here at the Leavenworth Air Service here at Fort Leavenworth, where the scouts have hands-on experience with the aircraft. They're able to climb aboard. They're able to see the instrumentation and get their hands on it. Turn in the theater. Up at uh, Rosecrans, the Memorial Airport, they were able to get, on a, get onto a C-130 aircraft, uh, see the cargo compartment, see the flight deck. They had a wonderful uh, briefing by the flight engineer there about all aspects of that aircraft. Very interesting for, for everyone there. It was very neat. Once it would lift, it would cut through, but it would lift better. Yeah, yeah, it's the right The C-130, it has an engine. Um, the engine is what hangs off out here, okay? And it's a big jet engine that spins, rotates, and moves. But these are across the top of the wing. We can reverse them and push air. Uh, they were also able to see the fire station, all the equipment associated with that. After we got the call for uh, in-flight training. Exercise message. Exercise, exercise, exercise. Well, C-130 inbound in-flight on C-130. 1-7, coming in 1-7. Exercise message only. Exercise, exercise. Uh, we rolled out and conducted a modulation, uh, which is a pump and roll feature. We vehicle in gear and were able to pump water. That way we could circle an aircraft and get to the uh, point of origin on the fire. The security police. I uh, gave an outstanding briefing. The optic sight, it is not a scope because we have no magnification. It's just a sight. Uh, it has a red dot in it. You guys will be able to see it when you come up here. And the thing that's great about the red dot sight is when you put the dot on it, that's where your round's going to strike. And something that many people don't get to do is go up in the tower where they had the two uh, technicians up there giving them a rundown of the aircraft operations, airport operations. Airplane is and his code that lets us do things with his strip. It's got a squawk, which is just a set of four numbers. And you can see up there when he turns back around, you can't really see it right now. But when he comes back, there will be these four numbers, 7250, and that's how we know it's him. Astro Tua tells you we're not in sight, check wheels down, wind 140 niner, runway 17 clear to land. During the mirror badge they were uh, asked to construct a model. Uh, essentially made out of a paper plate. Uh, kind of crude, but uh, we met at the, the scout room and uh, they were able to sh see how different aspects of aviation occur uh, by cutting flaps and rudders into the model and manipulating those. They could see how aircraft uh, fly and uh, what, well, for instance, a rudder, the aspect of the importance of a rudder, the ailerons and the stabilizer, and how all they work together to make stabilized flight.